With his face covered by a binder and surrounded by security, Joseph Fritzl sat in an Austrian courtroom Monday as his trial on charges of imprisoning his daughter for 24 years and fathering her seven children got underway. Fritzl entered a guilty plea to incest charges shortly after the start of the proceeding, but he's pleading not guilty to enslavement counts and to the murder of his daughter's newborn son. According to the trial prosecutor, Fritzl would go into the dark and filthy cellar built beneath his home only to rape his daughter Elizabeth, sometimes in front of their children. She went on to say Fritzl's daughter and victim was forced to live in the basement without a shower, hot water, and electricity. Meanwhile, Fritzl's attorney argued that his client is not a monster and that he regrets his actions. Court officials say jurors also heard videotaped testimony from Elizabeth during a closed-door session Monday. The jury is expected to hear more of that 11-hour recording and expert testimony on several issues, including the defendant's psychological condition on Tuesday. Joseph Leitner lived in Fritzl's house in the 1990s when the abuse was already going on. Leitner hasn't been called to testify, but he kept a close eye on Monday's proceedings. He says he hopes his former landlord gets the punishment that he deserves and that the victims can lead a comfortable life in the future. Fritzl faces a sentence of up to life in prison. A verdict in the case is expected by Friday. Mike Gracia, The Associated Press.